Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're covering a fairly quick topic. We're gonna to show you guys how to install the core edition of Windows Server. Before we get into that, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server, RDS licenses, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll put those links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, to keep this video very, very brief, we're gonna jump straight into the installation. Now, I basically ran an ISO, an image file of Windows Server 2022 to get to this screen. We'll put a link for where you can download that in the description box below from Microsoft's Evaluation Center. <clears throat> Just a quick note, the Evaluation Edition is not the full edition. And if you want the full edition, again, feel free to check out Indigo Software. We have those licenses for purchase in the description. So as we can see here, we've got the evaluation ISO opened. And one final note touching on that, if you are installing from the evaluation edition, you can simply run a series of commands through the PowerShell to upgrade to the full edition of Windows Server. So you can do it all from within and it's fairly easy to do so. Okay, so we can see that the evaluation editions are present here. And this is where we make the differentiation between the desktop experience and the server core version. So you can see we have standard evaluation, we have standard evaluation desktop experience, and the desktop experience is what's referring to the what we like to call the GUI, GUI, graphical user interface. That's gonna give you a visual server manager as well as a, you know, a desktop experience, a true desktop experience. Whereas the server core will basically be uh, some basic server admin tools and, and you can run the server with PowerShell essentially. So this is where you make that distinction. If I were to leave this here and click next, we would actually install the core version. Or if I wanted the desktop experience, we can click here. And then you just click next and it's gonna install that edition of it. So accept the license agreement. And I prefer to do a custom installation. Drive zero partition two is fine. And I'll press okay. All right guys, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you have any questions about that process, let us know in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server or remote desktop licenses or a wide variety of other software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. You can find those links down below. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.